What's up everybody, Dargul here, back again with another video. But this time we're going to be opening up this Flashfire X and Y little promo blister type thing. I don't even know what to call it. But this is an official Pokemon product. Here is the back, just in case you guys, you guys want to read that. And this is the Psychic type edition, hence the Sigilyph and the Duskinor right here. So this pack, or this blister I should say, includes 20 Psychic type Pokemon cards including two foil cards which are the two that you see right here and then one flash fire booster pack now they had a whole bunch of these in my target but they're like 9.99 and i don't know if i want to pay 9.99 for a basically one flash fire booster pack because these uh hollows are irrelevant except duskinor he was very dope main reason why i picked this one up there was some a water type one a grass one so many different kinds and they also had a more x and y three x and y base set blister packs which was amazing because i thought those would sell out by now but i guess they keep on restocking those so i might stop at that target to pick up some more for sure but without further ado let's just get right into this thing to answer the question is it worth it to get one of these let's see what kind of cards we get obviously you saw the card list back here so you already know what's up in that so let's just get this thing unpackaged and see what it's all about All right, y'all, so here is the main attraction people get this for, the Flash Fire Booster Pack. Obviously, that is the reason why I got it, too. I'm not even going to front. But here is the cards right there. It's a little bit warped, but, I mean, they put some piece of tape or whatever you want to call it, which is probably the worst way you can package these things. But let's see what we get on the Sigilyph side. So we got, obviously, the Hollow right there. We got a Cofagrigus, Swoobat, Garbodor, Woobat, Trubbish, Golit, Grimer, Gothita, she's very cutita. I don't even know, man. Don't even quote me on that. I don't. I have no idea. But then let's go to the Duskinor side, which is obviously going to be the more doper side. As oh, that Duskinor, Jesus, Jesus Cross, that is warped so bad right there. I can't even. I can't even. Hopefully a top loader will fix that. But we got a Espeon, Dusclops, Golbat. I told y'all, Duskull, Zubat. This is the doper side. Elgeon, this guy is very dope. Litwick as well. Muna is probably the, my least favorite out of that whole bunch. Espeon being second. Yeah, I said it. Yeah, I said it. But let's go to the main attraction, which is this Flash Fire Booster Pack. I'm hoping for a Charizard, but Flash Fire, let's shake this pack for some good luck. But Flash Fire is a very, very dope set, in my opinion. And here is the code, guys. I'm actually going to give this one to you guys. To see who actually gets the flash fire code. Would they actually put effort into their codes? Look at this. It's dope right there. The flames on the top. I'm not even going to rip this code. I'm actually going to keep that. Even though it's probably already going to be redeemed. But uh, who cares? Who cares? But let's see what we get. We got a dope looking Sentret right there. I love Sentret line for it. Ooh, Feebas. Another one of my favorite Pokemon. Bergmite. You got a Roselia. Gumi. Pidgeotto. Looking very dope. Oto. We got a Butterfree Rare Reverse, so that's good. And let's see what the last card is. A Dragalidge. I don't even know. I honestly don't even know how to say that Pokemon's name. So if you guys know, let me know in the comments down below. But damn, we got a regular Rare. I mean, we got the Butterfree Rare. See, this is why these things aren't really worth it. Because it's $9.99 for a Flash Fire Booster Pack. And you can probably find them cheaper online or in some other place. But you do get basically like a whole bunch of bulk and so forth. But without further ado, guys, in my opinion, these aren't really worth it. Because you do get two foils guaranteed. Are these even promos? No, these are actually from the set. So that's very dope. But however, they're warped, obviously. And then you get one pack, which is one chance, probably repackaged of some sort, even if it's not a third party, but still not worth it in my opinion. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.